roasted. This is my second version of my cleaner build. Some more, I like using this build for conflict. It's a conflict skill build, but it also works on the regular story mode or whatever you want to call it. Person vs. Computer PvP. This can be used for both. This right here is what made me fall in love with this build. Boost now active. Got him. The enemy is acquiring a boost. The boost has been taken by the enemy. Agent down. Fixer drone detected. This builds more. You can kill people with this build if you set them up in a trap skill builds or trap builds. But this isn't mainly what I use it for support. I use the chem launcher so I can set them on fire, get them away from me. And I use the turret or the drone so it can proc my in sync guns, my machine gun. And since I'm on skill tier 6, it hits really hard. That's why they're not pushing in because they keep trying to push in and they get shot by that drone and then they run away because it hits hard. Very strong on the defense side. Strong defense with this build is a good offense. It's hard to find teams that uh, don't just rush out and die over and over. If you post up and certain, it doesn't matter if you're in your spawn or somewhere else. As long as you are together and you have a team that works with you, 
you have this build and you stay in the back of everybody you're gonna you're gonna do really good this the first game I ever had five kills with all my other armors I can do it too but I don't know most of my builds for um PVE or survival builds like I try to survive more than just get the weapon damage because I don't have great aim roast now I want to show you the more attack side of this build because you can push with this thing now I have the shield instead of a um, drone give myself a little more protection seeing that you have a skill build on you can't be just getting shot like that but I wanted to make an attack version too destroyed this is a skill build you see do you see that that power and that's cause of the gun and the chem launcher as soon as I let's set you on fire you're done especially if you don't have hazard protection the fire is gonna like melt most of your armor and then that's why I could just run right through you Sometimes, even if they're not on fire, this gun is amazing. It shoots very accurate. I used to use it back in the day, but I never had a good one, so I found this one, so I started making builds off it. Look at that. I shot him up a little bit. The fire killed him. That's what's so good about this build. You don't need to shoot your opponent down all the time. If they don't have no hazard, as soon as you set them on fire and hit them with a couple of shots, they're finished. They're going to run away and die anyway. See what I mean about the, the shield? When you go on a tag version, you, you really can't take a lot of shots. Your shield, even though it's at skill tier 6, it's not going to take a lot of shots. Especially with these people, uh, weapon damage builds. You have to use your brain to uh, use this this build. You have to stay mobile. Sometimes you gotta run away from a fight. But if they don't see you and you attack first, it's a done deal. Great team in this build, you could do really good. You just gotta support your teammates, watch their back. Let them do the heavy lifting. You run around, set people on fire, and keep yourself alive.
let's jump into this. Starting off with the specialization technician, so I can get extra um skills here. We have the pyromaniac. Anybody lit on fire, 25% weapon damage. Got a guard roll. Submachine gun, perfectly in sync. Hannah Yu, face mask, skill damage, 10% skill status effect, and headshot damage mod. Hannah Yu, chest, spotter. Headshot damage mod, skill haste, and headshot damage I have on here. I got lucky. If you have a lot of headshot damage, the better your guns will be. Wyvern wear, holster, skill damage, and status effect. Sawyer's knee pads. Once you stay in place for a couple seconds, you, 10 seconds, you get 35% weapon damage. H Hannah U gloves, status effect, skill damage. Backpack, I forget the name of this, whatever, but uh, perfectly tech support, perfect tech support. Status effect, skill damage, and headshot mod. With all this combined, I think I have up to um, almost, I think 100% headshot damage. When you use this build, in the regular world, I don't have any um, footage. I didn't take any, but I'll, I'll show you some later on. I'm going to show a collage video of all my uh, builds in open world or legendaries. But if you have any questions about the build or don't understand something, just let me know. I'm using the spider chest piece, but if you didn't notice, I don't have the... Uh, the spot, the uh, pulse. That's because technician allows you to put a laser on your gun that will spot for you. So every time you point your gun at somebody, that's how they get spotted. That's how you activate the uh, chest talent. Or <clears throat> I use the attack drone, which also spots them for me. So I don't even need to point my gun at you. I just put my drone on you and now you're spotted. What's great about this build, what technique that I use, is uh, on like PvP. As soon as I point my gun at you or get my drone locked on you, I can see you through the walls now. And when I see you standing there waiting for me to come out, I'm just going to run around the corner and hit you with a chem launcher or put my drone on you. Like you seen with that one guy. He ran. I tried to hit him with the chem launcher. He ran around the corner. I waited for him. He waited for me. I can see through the wall. He can't. He doesn't know where I am. So I ran out, dive rolled, put my drone on him, dive rolled right back to the corner. And the drone was destroying him. I came out and hit him with like maybe a couple, half a clip. And he, he died. So you have to play very smart with this build. Regardless of what mode you're in. Because you do not have a lot of armor. But you hit really hard. And your skills hit really hard. But you will be hit hard. So you have to play smart. Well. It's another one for you guys. Hope you enjoy. Have any questions, hit that like button, subscribe, and put your comments down below.